showing you what I'm doing every day up until Christmas so it's gonna be a lot of fun there's so many things to look forward to like Hawkeye episodes every week just regular Christmas things and then also the No Way Home premiere I'm so excited for that I'm trying to think what the best thing we can do to start off today with obviously I'm wearing purple because of Kate you know Kate she just inspires me Maybe we'll try to do some Kate Bishop hair. That would be fun. I got nothing better to do. Well, actually, I do, but. Oh, come on, why not? I'm gonna multitask and talk about my Hawkeye theories while I wait for this thing to heat up. I'm multitasking. Here's my main theory. I don't think that, um, what's his name, Jack, I don't think he's bad. I don't, I, the first time I watched the episode two, I was like, oh, he's the bad guy. But then now when I watch it again, I'm like, I don't think so. But the mom, on the other hand, she sucks. She's really sus. Like, they never even said that Jack is the one who wants all the swords. And also, if you really wanted to kill the guy with that sword so bad, he would have, like, been so high on that sword. And also, he forfeited it, which makes me think it's a gift for the mom, and that she's the person who likes swords. It's warm now. Okay. This. That. That. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that was mediocre. I'll try again. Two, three, five. Like, just what you already knew was gonna happen. Like, I wonder what it would have been like 
watching WandaVision and not letting the Agatha, of, like, what's the Agatha Harkness already? Because I watched so many of those theory videos that it was like, I already know what's going to happen. So, it's more fun to just guess out of your own brain. But, if you guys have any theories, let me know in the comments. But I also, like, wonder how the mom would have gotten the sword from Jack since he had it in the last episode. Also, the fact that whenever Kate tries to bring up anything suspicious, the mom just shuts her up. So, what do you guys think? Do you think Jack is bad? I don't know. I really don't want him to be bad. Like, honestly, that would be so cool if he was like a secret agent. But he's an agent. He's taking his cover so seriously, like reading a book about being a stepdad. That's great. And also Pizza Dog. I love him. I hope they don't give him another name because Pizza Dog is a great name. Another theory I have is that Pizza Dog is not actually a dog. I think he's a scroll because Kate Bishop is supposed to become one of the leaders of the Young Avengers and the Avengers is like over. Like all the Avengers are gone. What? So okay. Nick Fury is like probably so bored of like yeah he was having his like vacation but I think he's over that point now. I think He's gonna want to put together another team, and I think he's spying on Kate with the dog. Yep. So, the dog was actually a scroll because he was like messing with Peter with a scroll, so, like, what's to say he wouldn't do the same to Kate? This isn't a theory, but I just get the feeling that Clint is going to miss all of his family's traditions. He's going to miss them all, and it's going to be so sad. And my mom was saying, like, because she's watching Combat 2, and she said, why doesn't Clint just bring Kate home for Christmas so that come back after Christmas and deal with everything? Because that would probably should be like so fun to watch because I'm hanging out so I don't know I don't know why Clint doesn't do that maybe like he doesn't want to draw attention to his house but I don't know also I'm really wondering how Yelena is going to play into all of this like if she'll just be a cameo at the end or what like the camera turned off I guess and I don't know where it landed but anyways I'm done now I did I Kate like Bishop the curls are on the wrong side okay guys now that I'm done we're gonna work on the footage from Hawkeye episode two, two and three. I haven't screen recorded them yet. So I'm gonna do that right now. And then we can do some planning for the Hawkeye bullet journal or laundry. I should probably do laundry first instead. While my Hawkeye footage is loading, I put in my laundry and then now I'm going to start on my bullet journal since I can't use the computer. I have it right here. There's my bullet journal. As you can see, this one got all ruined. But anyways, we're going to work on Hawkeye. Never. So, I've been really horrible about my bullet journaling. As you can see, I haven't been filling anything out. But it's December and honestly it's so helpful when I do fill it out so I'm just gonna ignore all my failure this year and keep going. Also I like got this radio at the antique store and it's really cool. 
I'll be able to listen to Christmas music when I'm doing my bullet journal, so that'll be fun. Like I said, it's gonna be Hawkeye theme, so I'm gonna grab all my Hawkeye color markers. We're gonna go for the aesthetic of the intro and the outro, which is purple, yellow, got purple paint marker. Also silver would be fun. And white for like snowflakes. Yeah. We'll just be taking it from there. Yellow, purple. That's our main colors. Different purple shade. Sunny purple shade. Darker purple. This is like the purple of my outfit. My shirt. You should get like a purple pen. I'm gonna start outlining the cover and stuff. start on the humors bullet journaling takes so much time but you know what it's so fun and at the end of the day i'm really proud of the spreads i made and i'm sure it'll help me keep on task the rest of the week so tomorrow we will get to working on those humor edits and yeah i'll see you then bye i love